My experience today has been energizing, uplifting, and nothing short of phenomenal. My experience today has been so memorable and so insightful. My experience was really surprising. I came in not really knowing what to expect, but I think it allowed me to absorb so much more. When we look at diversity and inclusion in, at AstraZeneca and our participation in Girls Belong Here, it's wonderful to hear the diverse inputs of young and inspiring women. Where should we be focusing our efforts around the environment and societal change and support? Um, and so for us, we learn as much from the day as we hopefully give back to the girls in terms of looking at what is their potential to be anywhere leaders are in an organization. I had heard so many great ideas, but there's a lot of conversation around really listening and learning. And the great piece of advice that I'm taking away is that when you're making big decisions, bring the right people to the table. Don't make a decision, don't assume, let them be part of the co-creation. We were discussing sustainability and I brought up discussion of accessibility and disability being overlooked in environmentalism. Uh, I told a story about how using paper straws is really difficult for me and I actually prefer plastic straws. This example provided an opportunity for disability to be at the forefront of a conversation and not as a back burner. So when we talk about environmentalism, diversity, inclusion, that disability is included. Just sitting down with such senior people in a really big company that I've also looked up to throughout my life as a woman in STEM. My favorite moment and openly talking to them about how I feel, I will come, giving them advice, like that was super uplifting. I was like, I'm a 20 year old giving like top people in a company advice. That was my favorite moment. One thing that stood out to me was the session with Jenna and Carlo. She mentioned that Sometimes we feel scared that in spaces we don't know what to contribute, but in any space that you're at, no matter what level, no matter your experience or background, you have something meaningful to contribute. And that stood, stood with me because I want to keep having that mentality everywhere I go. I was incredibly inspired today. The youth that we got to meet are affecting social change. And I think about myself uh, at their age and uh, I think, what was I doing? <laughs> This is truly a special group of individuals, and I have no doubt um, that not just them, but um, that generation is going to affect and must affect more change societally um, and for the planet. My favorite moment was when I was just talking to Jenna, and it was just such a casual conversation, but it was so insightful with the amount of advice she was giving. It was so easy and so smooth, like it was so chill. It's just really nice. It's been so inspiring to meet women my age who are just as eager to create change in the world. One thing I would like the youth to take away from today is that they can do anything. I want them to believe in themselves. I want them to know that change happens because of people and they have a role to play and they can make it happen. Don't doubt yourself. Don't have that imposter syndrome. Just go for it. It's important to meet women in leadership roles and in high positions of power so I can see myself in those positions. 